Hey, thanks for being a part of the conversation. This is Forest Stories. I am the poet in the forest, a children's series that I pinned out in the 1990s. Now, none of it would be possible if it wasn't for this forest right here in South Charlotte, North Carolina. I talk about it so much that I thought maybe it's time that you get to know what has inspired me for 30 years. Thanks for being a part of the conversation. Welcome back to the forest out here on this path. And I've come across three doe who are feasting morning breakfast. Yeah. I remember when I first came to this forest in 1992, there were always road signs, you know, warning people of the deer. And I remember my daughter looking at me while we were driving to school. Do you think there's deer in this forest? And I kind of laughed it off. I said, I think it's just a salesman's tool. I think those signs are to say, ooh, wow, all of these trees. We can sell some property if we make it look like the deer are here. And I got to be honest with you. Several years went by before the deer started to appear or we started seeing them. Mainly because of all of the construction that was outside this forest. It drove them to this forest and because we chose to protect this land. But to see these these doe this morning, three of them, just very calmly enjoying breakfast, I'm probably maybe seven feet from them. They're big, gigantic eyes, huge ears, a white tail, and nothing's bothering them. It's just the sound of spring and the deer eating their leaves, their grass. So many people... They didn't want them. And boy, did I ever get chastised a few years back. I I gave them corn. I I was feeding them during the winter months when there was cold snow on the ground. The winds were whipping. And I thought they need to eat. So I went out and got deer corn. And so many neighbors were so upset with me because I did that. And uh, today, which is really interesting, there are three or four different neighbors that are doing it. Those were neighbors that came after me because I was feeding the deer. But I'm glad that they're not looking for the feeders right now and that in this forest on this particular day, they are enjoying all that green. Hey, thanks for being a part of the conversation.